everybody's in on backflip, backflip. Double, double, oh, there it is. 24-year-old Simone Biles is an American gymnast who has taken the gymnastic world by storm, winning competition after competition while raking in medals and money. She's almost an anomaly were it not for the fact that she's a mixture of raw talent, the right physique, and a determined mindset. So, what more can we tell you about Simone Biles? Biles is one of the greatest ever, but who are the gymnasts who pose a threat for her Olympic dreams? We hope you enjoy the video. But before we get into the video, don't forget to leave a like and subscribe to the channel with notifications on so you don't miss any of the new videos we post. Tang Jing After the postponement of the 2020 Summer Olympics due to the COVID-19 pandemic, Tang competed at the delayed Chinese National Championships in September. As the reigning world all-around silver medalist, Tang was a favorite for the title. In the qualification round, she also served as the team final. Tang and Ki Ki led the Beijing provincial team to a fourth consecutive silver medal. Individually, a major error on uneven bars and a fall on balance beam caused Tang to miss qualifying for both of those event finals and to enter the all-around final in sixth place. However, a strong performance on floor featuring a new full-twisting double tuck allowed her to qualify to that final in third place behind Ki and reigning national champion Shang Tung Tong. After qualifications, Tang said she felt physically stronger as she hoped to overcome her pattern of making errors in the first round of a competition. In the all-around final, Tang improved on her qualifying performance to place fifth in the two-day combined all-around standings. Tang recorded the top beam score of the day by a wide margin after landing her new double pike dismount and earned the fourth highest score on both vault and floor exercise. Another major error on the uneven bars prevented her from making the all-around podium, with her training mates Wai Jing Guang and Ki Ki ultimately taking silver and bronze. In the floor exercise final, Tang also placed fifth, clean routine, less than a tenth from the podium. On July 3rd, 2021, Tang was selected to represent Present China at the 2020 Summer Olympics alongside Liu Yongfei, Wu Yushang, and Zhang Jin. She has an outside chance of posing a threat to Biles. Lenoy Ashram Lenoy Ashram is a rhythmic gymnast from Rishon Taisong, Israel. She won the 2018 World All-Around Silver Medal, two World All-Around Bronze Medals, the 2020 European All-Around Champion, and the Silver Medal in the 2019 European Games All-Around. The Israeli finished second in the World Championships in 2018 and third in 2019. She became the first gymnast to win back-to-back all-around victories on the World Challenge Cup circuit in 2018. She also became the first Israeli to win gold in the Grand Prix Final. Ashram now holds the title of European All-Around Champion, with the ROC choosing not to participate in the event due to COVID-19 related concerns. Ashram won a gold medal at the Gymnastics European Championship in Kyiv on September 29, 2020. She narrowly beat Alina Harnasco, her Belarusian competitor in an all-around competition with a total score of 100.9. This last success placed Lenoy Ashram as one of Israelis' main hopes for the 2020 Tokyo Olympics, which has been postponed to this year's due to the COVID-19 pandemic. In March 2021, she won two gold medals and one bronze medal in the Rhythmic Gymnastics World Cup in Sofia, Bulgaria. She also won five gold medals in the all-around individual, hoop, clubs, ribbon, and ball at the Grand Prix Tel Aviv. Angelina Melnikova. Angelina Romanova Melnikova is a Russian artistic gymnast who won a silver medal in the team competition for Russia at the 2016 Summer Olympics. She finished third in the all-around standings behind Olympic bars champion Aliyah Mustafina and 2014 Youth Olympic winner Seda Tatyanan. She was unable to compete in the final due to a regulation that only allowed two Russians per nation in each final. With the recent retirement of Mustafina, the ROC will need Melnikova to lead the way with her experience and the Olympics official website says the Russian is one to watch out for. Melnikova competed at the Russian National Championships in March. She finished third in the all-around behind new seniors Victoria Listanova and Vladislava Urasova. During the event finals, Melnikova won gold on vault, floor exercise, and bronze on uneven bars. Once again behind Urasova and Listanova, Melnikova was later selected to compete at the European Championships in basketball 
Health alongside Urizova, Listanova, and Elena Gerasimova. During qualifications, Melnikova qualified to the all-around uneven bars and floor exercise finals in first place and the vault final in second place behind Jessica Grinorova. During the all-around final, Melnikova fell off both the uneven bars and the balance beam but still managed to finish in second place behind Listanova. On the first day of event finals, Melnikova won bronze on vault behind Julia Steingruber and Gadirova and won gold on the uneven bars. On the final day of the competition, Melnikova won silver on floor exercise behind Gadirova. Melnikova competed at the Russian Cup in June 2021. During qualification, she finished in first place. During the all-around final, she fell off the balance beam and finished third behind Listanova and Urizova. After the competition, Valentina Radionoko, the senior coach of the Russian national artistic gymnastics team, announced that Melnikova would be on the Olympic team along with Listanova and Urizova. Melnikova is used to getting gold and knows what a threat Biles possesses. Will she be ready for the American in Tokyo? Sunisa Lee. Sunisa Lee is part of the United States women's national gymnastics team. She was a member of the team that won gold at the 2019 World Championships, where she also won silver on the floor exercise and bronze on the uneven bars. She won three medals at the USA Gymnastics National Championships during her first year as a senior elite gymnast, including a national title on the uneven bars. Lee qualified for the 2020 Summer Olympics as a main team competitor, becoming the first Hmong American Olympian. On the first night of the Olympic trials, Lee hit all four routines and posted an uneven bar score of 15.300. She ended the night in second place behind Biles. On the second night of competition, she once again hit all four routines. Lee scored a 58.166 on day two, scoring higher than Biles, 57.533. This was the third time in Biles' senior career and her first time since 2013 where someone posted a higher one-day all-around score. However, Lee's two-day combined score was less than Biles and she finished the competition in second place, which automatically qualified her to the Olympic team alongside Biles. Also named to the team were Jordan Childs and Grace McCollum. She has scored higher than Biles and could do it again. Jade Carey. Jade Ashton Carey is an American artistic gymnast. She's best known for her powerful and high difficulty exercises on vault and floor exercise. On vault, she is the 2017 and 2019 world silver medalist, the 2018 Pan American champion, and the 2017 United States national champion. On floor exercise, she is the 2017 world silver medalist and the 2018 Pan American champion. She was a member of the teams that won gold at the 2019 World Championships and the 2018 Pan American Championships and is a five-time member of the United States Women's National Gymnastics Team 2017 to present. In February, Carrie competed at the 2021 Winter Cup where she only competed on vault, uneven bars, and balance beam. She finished second on vault behind Jordan Charles, sixth on uneven bars, and ninth on balance beam. Following month at a national team camp, Carrie was named to the national team for the fourth time. During podium training for the national championships, Carrie debuted a laid out version of the Biles 2, triple twisting double salto. She may not surprise at this year's Olympics. Nina Derwal. Nina Derwal was born on March 26, 2000 and is a Belgium artistic gymnast. She's a two-time world champion, 2018-2019, and a two-time European champion, 2017-2018, on the uneven bars. Also the 2019 European Games champion on the balance beam and a two-time Belgium national all-around champion 2015-2018. She's the first Belgium gymnast to medal at the World Championships, the first to become a world champion, and the first to become a European champion. She also represented Belgium at the 2016 Summer Olympics and is scheduled to compete at the 2021 Olympics. Derwell returned to competition in March 2021 at the Belgian internal test meet after recovering from COVID-19. She won the all-around gold medal and the gold medals on all four events. She then competed at the Ossijek Challenge Cup and won the gold medal on the uneven bars and the balance. At this event, she debuted a new element on the uneven bars, a toe-on laid out Kozchev with a half twist, and the element was named after her. Then at the Flanders International Team Challenge, she finished fourth in the all-around, helped the Belgium team win the silver medal behind France, and won the gold medal on the uneven bars. Derwal is always a threat and may end up on the podium in Tokyo. That concludes our video. What do you think? Feel free to leave a comment. Thank you for watching. Be sure to check back again soon for another video. Until then, stay safe.